run him down. Keep him out of harm's way. Here's Greer rolling to his left and throwing across his body. Center of the field of Karan White. Makes the catch. The Cow Bears. So off the uh, incompletion, second and 10 now from the 25. It's Justin Crawford out of the backfield. And he is stopped for a long. Might see a deep ball here on third down and 11. The 24. Good pocket for Greer. And excellent defense. Knocked up Kevin Nagambi. And Booger McFarland. On first down and 10, here's Greer out throwing and completing to David Sills. And he's running away from people. And he's going to give up that to Jake Spavin. Hand off to Justin Crawford. He stumbles forward. When he's called plays. On second down and eight. Here's Greer in some trouble trying to run out of it. No can do. Those look so funny with numbers four and eight. Single digits. Yeah, they do. They're going to come just on a little stunt like this. And this offensive line for West Virginia is soft in the middle. At center and right guard, they have new players. They're Four numbers for Settle and Walker. Here's third down and 12. Greer has lots of time. Good loft on the football. It's up for grabs. And Sills can't. That they wanted with Sills, the tall wide receiver on Reggie Floyd at safety. I think this throw is affected by the pressure. Either way, great position by Floyd doing that. His mom, Teresa, had him do it when he was just a pup. Here's Kennedy McCoy. This was catch pal. They take that stuff very seriously in Blacksburg. He said it means everything to him. It's everything they are. Look at everywhere they go. Mountaineers are moving fast. Here's Greer in some space. And he's got another first gain of 12 on the play. And it's West Virginia on the move all of a sudden. And he's sticking that ball in there, giving it to McCoy that time. He pulls it out in the hold of the defensive end. Loses contain. Hokies are creeping up the line of scrimmage. But they're just rushing four. Greer has time to throw it down the sideline. And was looking for three receivers bottom of his screen now. On second down and ten. Throw it out to one of them. Here's Gary Jennings. Pick up of maybe one on the play. Still trying to pick up that first third down. Conversion. And there it is. And so far for the Mountaineers. Approaching the final minute and a half. Of quarter number one. Greer trying to make people miss. Second and 11. Greer looks to his left. Again, plenty of time. And good coverage. The ball is not the ropes. See the numbers on Greer. Here's third and 11. Again, all sorts of time. Great protection. And with all that time, finds Gary Jennings for the first down. Effective. No Tim Settle on the defensive line. That's Hewitt that gets in there. There's absolutely no pressure. And you give any quarterback that amount of time. And I'm going to pick you apart. Here's the tenth play. Greer to throw again. Oh, man, wide open, and Jennings couldn't. That's the, certainly this could be a better throw. It's just a cross route here. Sills is going to come down to the inside and affect the safety. And if that ball's a little bit, exactly that ball's going to come out. Second down and ten. Finally a run. It's McCoy with a change of pace down to the 25. The dead 25. Virginia Tech. Greer the throw to David Sills, and he can't get to the most 16 on uh, fourth down attempts last season. On uh, fourth and two, here's Greer. Going to throw it. He's going to be intercepted. Picked off by Trayvon Hill. The worst possible save. From alignment, you're going to see four guys from the outside for Virginia Tech. You get in this position. There they are right there, and he's just trying to get the ball here. And this is Hill right here with a great athletic play. Outstanding response, but that was, from a schematic standpoint, Bud Foster was ready for that naked throw, and Hill makes a great play. Yeah, with you everywhere as well. First play on the new series. Here's Justin Crawford turning the corner. The interception. Well, here's a guy with a wife and a kid. And it's much more case with Will Greer and Jake Spavlo and West Virginia. There's a flag down as he completes to David. Holding. Offense. Number 79. 10-yard penalty. First down. His offensive coordinator in his life these days. He said to be living in the football office. Here's Justin Crawford breaking a tackle lower in his shoulder. He hurts. Greer, down the middle of the field, had Garrett. 
down with these guys. Third and 15. Yeah, the pocket is clean. Greer able to hook up with David Sills, but he's going to his knee left for a play or two, but that's good news for that defensive line of the Hokies. Justin Crawford is the ball. Another well, beating last night for him to go down with a knee, just a, a real hook up. There's Crawford, breaks a hole right up the middle. And they'll bring him down from behind. Thor 42, talk longest about, play of the game. We talk about getting Crawford involved here. You're going to see Wellman come up on the inside, get a great block on the linebacker to free up Crawford. And West Virginia, they want to go fast. That time, Kenny did McCoy now in. to give Crawford a breather. And it is McCoy, the ball carrier. The right of Greer now in motion. Put him in a slot. Here's Greer. Across the middle. Looking for Bush. And the little guy able to stay on. Three to snap it. They get it away. Here's Greer. Quick throw. Complete to Karan White. The last time to try to convert on fourth down led to an interception. Here's Greer off the play fake. And throw and complete. Field. Gain of 12. This is their deepest penetration of the game so far. Down to the Hokie 13. Greer gonna keep it. And he's tripped. He's got the size. Number 13 in the slot. And a flag. Ball start. Offense. Number 62. Five yard penalty. Second down. That is. Greer gives it to him. And McCoy picking and choosing. Greer to throw on third and eight. Lofts one, and it is caught! David Sills! Touchdown! West Virginia! The back position. <laughs> He's got everything else. Third and five after a couple of injuries. Here's Greer on the run, trying to pick it up on the scramble. I don't think he can... Holding. Offense. Number 79. Penalties declined. Going to play sideline warning on Virginia Tech. That's their first of the game. Fourth down. West Virginia handles this. It's Justin Crawford. Scampering out for a first down, trying the right side up. Ripped off a big chunk for 60 earlier. On second down, it's Crawford again. And that should do it. For really tough time separating from Terrell Edmonds in particular. Yeah, give the ball to Justin Crawford, averaging nearly eight yards a carry, and that average will go up. For 100 yards rushing here in the game tonight. And again, we are early third quarter. Mix the run and then the pass. And the Sills jumped back at the opportunity to be a wide receiver in Morgantown. Here's another wide receiver making a play. Anderson tell Todd right before halftime they have to protect Will Greer. That's exactly what happens here. Look at the pocket. He's bouncing back and forth. And if you can have time to throw that ball down the field one-on-one, -on -one, make a play with Karan White. Three plays, three first downs. 30 side the five. Greer, quick throw to Tevin Bush. Greer off his back foot, back of the end zone. And now they've got a lead to protect. 17-10. Here's Greer in some trouble. Throw it against his body. And he sailed it. The officials missed a clear hold here on Kajus, the left tackle. Trevin Hill beats him off the line of scrimmage, and he gets a big piece of that uh, jersey. Lucky to get away with that one. West Virginia's paying rent at the 25-yard line, their own 25. For the sixth time, they started from there. Swing it out. Kennedy McCoy trying to protect a seven-point lead here. Nine minutes to play, third quarter, and Greer going for it down the sideline. And the place better than 80,000 strong. Watching the kind of game you would expect from these two rivals. 17-10, Virginia Tech. 55, five-yard penalty, first down. Interior, and they lost Lingenfelder. First and 15, Greer throwing, has a man, only one man to beat, Karan White couldn't stay on his feet. On his feet, on first down and 10 now. Greer throwing to the left. Gary Jennings creating some running room. I'm interested to see what this play is. First down and 10. Greer throwing, right side, bounces up in the air. Ben Boma back with us in the booth. 
for our travels across the college football landscape all season long. Kennedy to come with pressure predominantly in this game. Here's Greer. Back foot throw. Has a chance, and it's Gary Jennings. Just across the 20. On the draw. Just beyond the 16. Greer off the play fake. Again, the pocket is clean now, and it's some pressure trying to step up and step away. And he takes a big hit. Duo Alpaca makes the stop. <laughs> Nothing downfield. Good job. He didn't, if he threw that slant on the weak side, Tremaine Edmonds was going to intercept it. Nice job pulling it down, and he's got just enough. Fake handoff from Greer. And a complete to David Sills. Greer off the low snap. He's taking a shot down the field for Gary Jennings, and he has that two. 43 on that play. Now the handoff, the changeup to Justin Crawford, and not much over in the pocket. Second and six, put four to Jennings. He's a 330-pound defensive tackle, can't handle it. Third down and one. It's Crawford had time to pin. They got a hold. In the 55. Same yard penalty. Third down. That's Kajust. Here's Greer. Great protection. Lofts it downfield. End zone, and it's knocked away. Actually, right. Let's go back and look at Kajust. There he is right here. Was this a hold? He bounces it out, and I mean, that's. Company matched all of our donations. Yeah, very cool. Good on you, Levy, for donating. I know you donated too. Nice to play after Hurricane Harvey did what it did to Houston. And the surrounding area. Here's Greer across the middle. What concentration by Gary Jennings. Stays on his feet for the touchdown. Page and timing with his receivers. Take a look at this throw. It's just man-to-man -man coverage. Terrell Edmonds is there. And this is just trust. Trust in Gary Jennings that he's going to go up and make a play or nobody's going to make it. Todd McShay in the middle of it all. Greer on the delayed handoff. Second down and eight. Hand off again. It's Petaway. He has the first down, and he puts 513 total yards offense against this Virginia Tech defense. And they're looking for more. We are firing. Put to work on the preseason broadcast. Thank you. Too. Thanks for tuning in. I tune in every time. Second down and ten. Swing it to Kennedy McCoy. Ocean, top of your screen. On third and eight. Here's Greer. Under some pressure, rolling and throwing. <laughs> How's that possible? Is that the check mark? Yeah, the blue check. Here's Greer firing for Karan White. Goes up for From the 25, again, Greer. The quick out to Gary Jen 19 times. Here's third and five. Greer under pressure, gets rid of it. Reynolds with a little bubble screen pump and go. And Reynolds wasn't buying. Will Greer off the draw to Kennedy McCoy, and he's got to win the game late in the fourth quarter if you have any gas left in the tank. Here's Greer. No pressure. Down the sideline. And a man wide open. You on the way to make that hit. Can still be effective. Draw play again to McCoy. And again, he has a first down. Greer to throw. Some late pressure. Now he'll step up and run. Has the first down. They have gas left in their legs. Everybody else is done. 60 ticks left. Here's Greer throwing sideline. 12. Greer, quick throw. Quick catch to Gary. Going by seven. Greer going for it. And nearly intercepted. Fourth down. Here you go. One for two on fourth downs in the game. Greer getting out of there. Needs five. He's got it. Got the first down. Now they're set. It runs. Half minute to go. Greer throwing sideline. Greer under pressure and he's taken down. Bud Foster decided to bring the pressure again. They're going to bring this twist dog right here with the linebackers, Tremaine Edmonds. One of two ways to approach it, right? You can sit back in zone and let. Greer looks to his right. In trouble now. Has to get out of there. And does 
He'll have the first down. There's a couple of touchdown catches. Jennings has made big plays. Here's Graham. Throwing. End zone. It was there. It was open. Here we go. Final play. Regulation. And there's a flag. And there's another flag. Multiple fouls on the offense. Holding. Offense. Number 79. Penalty for five. Personal foul. Illegal block. Number 79. Time. Game is over.